saying hello to me, that lousy wench? Right from the moment when I met her, saw her. I that lousy you... wench I forgive immediately because she's hot. Today's the day when all of your dreams come true. <laughs> You haven't even heard my I Want song yet. Let's get to it right now. To have someone understand the concept of pacing. Not that I'm one to talk. Ah, the town's getting sucked into a black hole! The home got more adventure than even she in her wildest imagination could have dreamt. But through a series of strange circumstances, she found herself held captive. Really? No elaboration, no details, just a series of strange circumstances? You might want to rethink your career writing for Spark Notes. Elizabeth Bennet had several sisters, an overbearing mother, and an apathetic father. Then some other shit happened, and Mr. Wickham turned out to be a douche nozzle. Master will be furious if he finds out what we are up to. Whatever it is that we are up to. We'll keep it simple. What are you talking about? What Chip speaks for the audience. Come on, Mom. Come along, Chip, dear. Oh, dear. No need to worry. We'll keep it simple. Hi! Was each line written on a separate card right before a game of 52 picked up? If we're going to do this, then let's do it. I now approve for a reason. But enough dragged out dance numbers, it's time to return to Rush Dialogue. I am the master of this castle! You're just now introducing yourself. She'll never see me as anything but a monster! He hasn't seen you at all yet. Try to understand, master. The poor girl has lost her father and her freedom all in one day. What father? I thought I told you never to come here! No, you didn't. I am, I apologize. Really? Really? No saving her from wolves, no actual indication that he has a good side, just a hastily mumbled apology that sounds less convincing than if Edward Cullen says he respects you as your own person, and she goes for it? What happened to you, Belle? That's it. Chin, chin, chin. I've never felt this way before. I've never felt this rushed before. What sweet! He barely mumbled sorry! You've gone through the entire emotional arc in 15 seconds with no visible motivation! Because you just met him! She's never looked at you at all before two minutes ago! And who'd have guessed they come together on their own? In just five minutes! A few days more! There may be something there that wasn't there before. Like character motivation. You know, perhaps there is something there that wasn't there before. Like shared stage time. There may be something there that wasn't there before. Like any semblance of plot development. Bell has to be done for the last time. It was also the first time we only met once. Oh, I am disgraced! Someone has to protect our village! Kill the beast! Ah, wait, what beast? Yeah, this is the first we've heard about any beast. Come on, man! Let's go get him! He just said out loud that this was just a plan and they're still falling for it. Most easily duped mob ever. Excuse me, sir, I'm trying to trick you. May I see your wallet for a minute and not run away with it? Well, you were upfront about trying to trick me, so I guess you're an honest fellow. Ha! Tricked you! There's nothing in here but a Blockbuster card. If you're not with us, you're against us! Nobody said they're not with you. Face it, beast! You're a fool that think Bell could have a monster like you! I somehow knew you thought that. And Gaston just wanders off without retribution. For great justice! Bell. You came back. When did she ever leave? When did you try to warn him? How is this your fault? I can't has clarity? 
So whatever happened to the servants? Oh, I'm sure they're fine. Well, Gaston's still on the loose. Hey, Karma will catch up to him. Didn't someone mention me having a father? He went to live on a farm where we could play with all the other fathers. Snow White's dad. Cinderella's dad. Phineas and Candace's biological dad. Is he at least reunited with mom? Nah, she ran off to Acapulco with Ariel's mom. Thank <laughs> you.